Welcome back to JC Motive Garage. After going store to store, ordering them and getting the wrong ones and they were too big, we finally got the gaskets for the RSX exhaust. So we're about to put them on and see how bad these gaskets are. So let's get started. So we already got the car jacked up and we already have our jack stand underneath. So let's get this apart and let's see how bad this exhausts are, gaskets are, and let's replace them. All right, let's get underneath here and taste the, take this exhaust apart here. Let's see. Side should be loose enough now. Let's get the bolt out of there. There we go. Let's get the other one here. And let's get this loose. Alright. Exhaust pipe is starting to fall now, so let's get this bolt out of here. And let's see. Oh, the gasket's burnt. Here, let's get this out of here, here. And that's what's left of the gasket. That's an eBay exhaust gasket for you. So, if you ever buy an eBay exhaust, my suggestion is replace your gaskets. Go get new ones because the same thing did to the header up there. I've had to replace that one too. So, let's get the new one installed. Oh. All right, let's throw this up here. And, oh, she fits good. I like that. All right. Let's try to climb underneath here and let's get this bolt in this right here. All right, let's get this bolt inside here. I think the other side of this. Oh, yep. Yeah, there's the other part of the gasket. There was oh. actually two gaskets on there. So they separated. It was supposed to be a thick gasket. No wonder it was leaking. And the check engine light was on for a knock sensor. Let's throw this one in here. See this one? This one's actually not flimsy. It's hard. So this one's going to be a lot better. So... Let's get this in here, and as soon as we get this side done, we will go to the back side, and we'll get the other one put in. All right, let's throw these bolts in here, and let's tighten this up. All right, there's one side. Oh, oh I forgot to put the washer on it. Let's pull this out here. My hand's in the way. Alright, sorry, my hand, my elbow's in the way here. I'm trying to get this bolt up. Now it won't come out. Now it doesn't want to come out of here. Oh. Because the nut is still on it. That's probably why that bolt didn't want to come out. Alright. Let's get the washer on there now. And let's put this back together. And. There we go. And. Let's tighten this up here. It should be tightening now. There we go. So, let's put the other nut on the other side here. Is my elbow in the way? Huh? No. Alright, there you go. Alright, there we go. Alright, let's get this tightened down now. 
So I'm gonna do this one, and after I do this one, I'm just gonna fast forward because the other one's about the same, and then we will uh, start it up, and we'll see how she sounds. So see you back in a minute. So we just got the other gasket installed, so we got both the gaskets installed, so I'm gonna let down the car, and we're gonna start it up, and we're gonna see how it sounds. so much better doesn't it all right well that concludes the video on putting the exhaust gaskets on the RSX now we can move to something else so now that we got the gaskets installed on the RSX finally after like I said going from auto parts to auto parts store trying to find them I had to go to two different auto parts stores to find both the gaskets. One was at one place and one was about a couple miles down the road. So we finally got that done. It sounds good. So in the next video, we will uh, check about the check engine light and the knock sensor. And if it's still, the check engine light is still off, then we will move on to something else. So hope you liked the video. Don't forget to comment, subscribe and leave us a comment and leave us a comment below and that's it for our jc motor garage